Our next AIOS endowment lecture is named after uh, Professor L. P. Agrawal. Professor L. P. Agrawal is a legend in his own way. He was the founder of the Dr. R. P. Center for Ophthalmic Sciences, named after the first president of India. And he was instrumental in setting up the national program for the control of blindness, which was perhaps the first in the world that any country set up a national program exclusively for the control of blindness. And Professor Agrawal was not just a great teacher, a mentor who literally trained generations of ophthalmologists, but he also realized, like Dr. G. Venkataswamy, that this is not something that can be done only by doctors. So he also started paramedic training and diploma in ophthalmic techniques. And he also started a federation of eye care institutions to promote vision sciences, the Federation of Ophthalmic and Optometry Research and Education Center. This year, the All India Ophthalmology Society is proud to confer the AIOS LP Agrawal Endowment Lecture on Professor Jagat Ram Sir, again a living legend. He was the head of Department of Ophthalmology at the prestigious Postgraduate Institute of Medical Research and retired as its director, a world-renowned pediatric ophthalmologist. He's also been confirmed Padma Shri by the President of India. In 2019, he completed 40 years in PGI-MR. We look forward to hear from you, Professor, sir. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, first of all, I am thankful to All India Ophthalmological Society. Uh, they are not present here. Dr. Varun Nayak, President. Dr. Harbans Lal, Dr. Lalit Verma, Dr. Namrata Sharma. Uh, those present here, uh, Dr. Partha Vishwa, Chairman Scientific Committee. Dr. Prakshit Gogate uh, for uh, considering me for uh, a prestigious Dr. L.P. Agarwal Endowment Lectures. It is a great honor and opportunity for me. My regard to my respected senior colleagues delivering endowment lectures, uh, Dr. Abhay Vasavada, Dr. R.D. Ravindran, Dr. Madan Desh Pandey, Professor Ajwardhan Azad, and other colleagues, and uh, all the uh, dear delegates. Uh, a topic uh, given is uh, the science of ophthalmology and my philosophy. Professor L.P. Agarwal has already said a legendary and visionary ophthalmologist of the country, founder chief of Dr. R.P. Center for Ophthalmic Sciences. He planned the first ever blindness control program of India, national program for control of blindness. He received several prestigious awards like gold medal, for research in trachoma eradication from World Health Organization and Lifetime Achievement Award. His contribution to the modern Indian ophthalmology were so profound that he can be aptly called the father of modern Indian ophthalmology. As for any person, guru is most important and uh, whether it is a spiritual guru or worldly guru. I owe my sincere gratitude to the founding father of our institute at PJMER Chandigarh. These were the director before me. I also owe my gratitude to my mentor and teachers. I had opportunity to work with Professor Ayajan and for long time Professor Amod Gupta. I owe my gratitude to my mentor and uh, uh, in pediatric cataract surgery. While working with uh, Dr. David Apple, who is my inspiration, uh, I also got opportunity to work with Dr. Amy Wilson. Uh, in Charleston, USA, that initiated my major interest in pediatric cataract surgery. I consider Professor uh, Dr. Abhay Vasabada pioneer uh, of modern pediatric cataract surgery in the country, and he is my inspiration. My family has been greatest pillar of strength and uh, 
have constantly provided me positive store, uh, support and affection every day. This is the photograph in 1990 and now uh, other photograph is 2022. Uh, you can see uh, Professor Ayajan, Professor Amod Gupta, uh, Professor Dogra uh, worked uh, together for 40 years and now I am after uh, retirement I am working with uh, Dr. SPS Greval. Uh, this is our young team at PJMER Chandigarh faculty and uh, we were there for uh, 42 years together. The progress over the century in ophthalmology has been due to intellectual curiosity and passion of, for science. Uh, whether it is the uh, first uh, ophthalmologist which we consider Dr. Sushruta or uh, Sir Harold Ridley or Kelman. As I trace my route, it makes me immensely surprised and emotional to note how far one can reach by sheer hard work and persistent dedication. Uh, this story is of 42 year. In 1979, while I joined PGI, uh, started with intracapsular cataract surgery. 1985, extracapsular cataract surgery with the PCIUL. Then phaco emulsification with posterior chamber IOL implantation and uh, later in 2010 with uh, phemato surgery, phemato cataract surgery. Lot of work has been done in the community of ophthalmology, contributed free services to over 150 mega camps in Punjab, Haryana, Himachal and Chandigarh since 1979. Provided free surgical services in the mega eye camps at Radha Swami Satsang Bias. I had opportunity to serve the Republic of Seychelles on deputation from PGI as a consultant ophthalmologist from 2003 to 5 and successfully eliminated the backlog of cataract blindness that time. It was an honor to write a complete issue of survey ophthalmology in 2000. Elimination of cataract blindness, a global perspective entering new millennium and to analyze the largest database of the world of the pseudophagic human eye obtained post-mortem and both these publications made global impact. It was also honored to publish in New England Journal of Medicine which is a high impact factor journal and introduce uh, uh, an artificial platform for intraocular lens implantation in a fake patient with inadequate support uh, which is under patenting. From the small beginning year after year I have diligently worked to serve the thousands of the children who were brought with billions of the hope at our doorstep and to educate hundreds of the young mind who want to become leader of ophthalmology tomorrow. Why pediatric cataract surgery? Pediatric cataract surgery is a neglected surgical procedure in ophthalmology, high rate of complication, most uh, powerful draw was preventing childhood blindness due to pediatric cataract. This became my biggest passion, mission and obsession. I, I developed completely focused motivation and strong will to turn that into reality. These are some of the publications in pediatric cataract surgery uh, with high impact factor. While these children come to us, they come with visually significant cataract, most of the time bilateral and sometime even unilateral and we dilate each of the eye and see the anatomy of the cataract. There are several issues of concern uh, or uh, consideration which has to be done in these children. Dilated stridum examination is important. IL power calculation increase in axial length of these growing eyes, IL implantation or uh, uh, to be done or not. These, they may get uh, marked inflammation postoperatively, management of amblyopia. Aim is to provide a clear visual axis and, 
visual long term visual rehabilitation uh, this is a very small i don't want to teach uh, pediatric cataract surgery but uh, this is a very small uh, video clip to sh show how we teach uh, uh, to our uh, resident and trainee ophthalmologist uh, after making side port and main incision uh, doing continuous curvilinear capsular axis removal of the cortex after uh, hydro dissection and then making the posterior capsulotomy in younger children younger than 6 years and completion of the posterior axis which is kept about uh, 3.5 or so and then uh, in the bag implantation of hydrophobic acrylic IOL. And even uh, at present uh, we also did study on uh, femato cataract surgery in pediatric much more commonly is toric IOL implantation and selectively multifocal IOL implantation. These are some of the publications in the field of persistent fetal vasculature with cataract. Seeing the contribution uh, more than 12,000 uh, 12, pediatric cataract surgery, 134 publication out of 450 are in the field of pediatric cataract. 172 lecture including orations, mentoring of resident uh, in ophthalmology 154 for the last 42 years, award and honors uh, more than 30 award in the field of pediatric cataract surgery. Uh, surgery is just the first step, long term follow, is impo uh, follow up is important. Uh, see this child uh, where we did, I did cataract surgery with uh, a uh, primary posterior capsulotomy and anterior vitrectomy that point of time in 1997 and the same child after 25 years uh, having 20 by 20 visual acuity has grown up now doctors after completion of MBBS. <laughs> Ophthalmology in general and pediatric uh, cataract surgery in uh, particular has been my life and it is it has given me many moments to be proud of these are some of the award innovative surgical on innovative surgical procedure which brought global recognition for advanced eye center pgi and uh, these are some of the best of the best award and oscar of pediatric ophthalmology and small clip i will like to play Now the winner in this category reminds me, I, I watched this video over and over and over. As some of you know, I have loved magic from the time I was a child. As I watched this video, I realized that the producer had to love magic too. In producing this video, you can see the level of skill, compassion, and technology that went into showing what we as ophthalmologists can ideally do. This is magic. The winner is management of double crystalline lens. Jagat Ram from Chandigarh, India. This was another uh, uh, moment uh, which was, uh, I am proud of that Jagat moment. Dr. Ram Chikitsa Netra Vigyan. Uh, 
another uh, proud moment for me was while I became director of PGIMER Chandigarh. Uh, very difficult, uh, but anyway, uh, it was not political. Uh, my philosophy, uh, in order to achieve excellence, we need to take a small step every day. I will not go into detail. Uh, positive and high thinking. Be a lifelong student. Have deep level of interest in the career you choose. To excel, you must teach. Hard work and dedication. Focus is the most important step. Pursue, innovate and invent. Take failure in your stride. And what I consider one of the most important is team approach and harmony. You can see three of us at PGIMER Chandigarh. We have worked for uh, more than 42 years together without any fight. And another is professional connectivity. Share your knowledge with your colleagues, with your, uh, with your senior and juniors. I believe in empowering the next generation for progress. These are my residents, Dr. Anirudh Agrawal, Dr. Anand Vinekar and Dr. Simar Agrawal. They got top award nationally and the best, the gold medal too. Once again, I thank all the children, more than 10,000 children where, uh, who gave me opportunity to serve them and I am thankful to All India Ophthalmological Society for giving me this opportunity uh, to for uh, delivering uh, this uh, Dr. L.P. Agarwal endowment lecture. Thank you very much.